believe at heart ours is a decent country, a country of rule of law, democracy, and freedom, where people who work hard, do the right thing, can get on in life and provide for themselves, their family, and their community, where genuine problems and injustices are tackled with energy and good faith. Now, my answer, and I'm sure I know your answer, is a resounding yes. But that's why I am so saddened by a small but very vocal group that profoundly disagrees. They see a completely different Britain, dominated by privilege and oppression, that should view its values and history with shame. A mantra that results in bullying and haranguing of individuals, elected representatives, and public institutions. That so-called cancel culture. And we've all seen this simplistic narrative in action. Divisions are heightened, statues torn down, history rewritten. But conference, I'm afraid it's actually much worse than that. Anyone who dares resist this argument, anyone who objects to this woke aggression, is branded as instigating culture wars. It's quite extraordinary. Like our equalities minister, Kemi Badnock, who has suffered relentless abuse from the left. Kemi, we are with you all the way.